Hello, I'm Andy, <clears throat> and I'm going to read to you a program called Tarot, using my Kabbalistic tarot cards, Your Love Story, for the month of June 2018. And this is for you, you coming from Gemini. So let me get my cards done. And the first card that I'm going to pull for you will be to predict your first 15 days of June. And they are going to be marvelous, lucky, happy first 15 days of June. This card shows you have many possibilities of contacting a new romance and you'll be found very attractive. So do your best, look your best, be at places you can attract people and you will see that the first 15 days provides you with this new contact which may easily turn into a new romance. If you have an ongoing romance, it's going to be very happy and it's going to be stable and it's going to provide you plenty of support. So good things are happening in the ongoing romance as well. And if you are married, it shows plenty of stability and understanding and plenty of solutions found where perhaps in the previous month you couldn't find the solutions. So the marriage has a total niceness, even extended family members, your siblings, your parents are being very helpful. So the marriage and family areas are really wonderful for you in the first 15 days. This card that I pulled next will have to do with your last 15 days for you coming from Gemini. And this is not a good card. It shows that things go very bad in the new romance that you may have found earlier. And if you do find a romance in the last 15 days, tell yourself it's coming loaded with complications and problems. <clears throat> and if you have an ongoing romance, there's going to be many issues left, right and center. And this shows that things can turn very bad, extremely bad in the ongoing romance that can stretch it to breaking point. So if you value it, you definitely don't want to argue, don't want to be stubborn, don't want to show your temper. So a very difficult card in the last 15 days for you. And in your marriage areas, this card also shows that things can get extremely tense and difficult. And again, if you value your marriage and your family, you don't want to be the one who provocates anybody. So be calm, take a step back, Take a deep breath whenever you are being challenged by your marriage partner and take it easy and tell yourself it's only the last 15 days, it's only 15 days, they will pass and look forward to the next month for finding solutions. <clears throat> so that's what I have to tell you basically. Now for you coming from Gemini, I'm going to pull the next card and this is to give you your lucky dates, D-A-T-E-S, your lucky dates and your lucky dates with this card are for the month of June, the 4th, the 5th, the 4th, the 13th, the 22nd and the 31st. The 4th, the 13th, the 22nd and 31st. Bookmark these because you're going to be very lucky on morning, noon, afternoon, evening, night time of these four dates in month of June. Looking for the romance, this is the dates you must go all out and make your contacts. And this will be the dates which will help you do the bonding, whether in the romance or the marriage areas. So use them to find your love story, put them, put your love story on the perfect footing. The next card which I'm going to pull for you will be regarding your ages. So this group of ages is going to be very lucky. And if you happen to be the ages of 22 or 31 or 40 or 49 or 58 or 67 or 76, you are going to be one very lucky person with a love story that's going to provide the romance or improve your marriage or find a new one is all be waiting for you. If you are not of these ages, you'll have to have the 90 minute one session with me whereby I will tackle all areas of your life and it'll cost you USD 50, but I'll talk about that to you later. Now this next card that I pull will have to do with your colors. And the colors that I've chosen for you for this month of June. I'll have to go with the color white because I see the signs of Mercury and Uranus there. So I favor white for you. So try and wear white as much as possible. Undergarments, top garments, contact white and you will have your love story sparkle because these colors actually will bond with your good planets of love. And that's how you manage your, your love story for the month of June wearing plenty of white plenty of white. And of course, when you do have a session with me one day of 90 minutes, I'll give you a lot of other information as well. The next card that I pull for you is to show 
which person from which sun sign like Cancer or Aries or Sagittarius might provoke, might give you problems in the month of June. And this card has signs. I like to use Kabbalistic cards because they have zodiac signs and they have planetary signs. And here it shows somebody from Cancer <coughs> is going to provide plenty of difficulties for you in the month of June where love story is concerned, whether marriage, whether romance, whether the new one is concerned as well. So if you happen to have a partner who is from cancer, you'll have to be very careful and treat that partner very, very carefully. Otherwise, a clash is going to be seen very, very easily. Now, the next card that I pull will be to do with somebody who may be very interested in you, somebody you may be very interested in. And this card shows it would be somebody from Scorpio who is very showing a lot of interest in you. So with this card, if you meet anybody in Scorpio, have it in your mind that uh, romance may bloom. And even the new romance who might be interested in you, if you find the person is from Scorpio, I would say that it's a good sign. So keep a lookout for somebody from Scorpio who is interested to you. And if vice versa, if you're interested in somebody from Scorpio, you should make the move. Well, that's what I have to tell you for the month of June for your love story. I'm already Skyping and I'm charging USD 50 for a 90 minute Skype session. And this will be based on your date of birth, your time of birth and looking at your palms and face reading you while I Skype with you as well. And during these 90 minutes, I'll tackle all areas of your life, your job, your business, your finance, your health, every area, including your love story areas as well. So go to Facebook, go to Skype, leave me a message and I'll come back to you and we'll, we'll communicate and get a date to have this 90-minute Skype session. Until then, thank you. Good luck.